One thing that everyone seems to dramatically underestimate or misunderstand is what memes are and their power. Because people talk about humans, societies, subcultures, AI, the internet, art. People, people talk about all these different things, but there's actually like a much more elemental, simpler thing going on here, which is these replicating behaviors, right? And even an idea is just a kind of a behavior. An idea is the behavior of thinking that idea. And so if you look at things that may look very different from the outside, like a person or a social network or an algorithm and all these kinds of stuff, but when you just kind of take off the glasses that look at the vessel and look at this proverbial spirit within the behavior itself, the meme, the invisible replicating information network, it can get a lot simpler because then it's just like, for example, oh, there's this behavior of having conversations and turning snippets into media. And, you know, maybe Naval, as an example, can be very, get very good at that behavior. And then he can make software to facilitate that behavior, which we're using right now. And then the behavior can spread to more and more people with more ease. And so if you look at it from an outside perspective, then you're like, okay, well, this is a person, this is media they make, this is software, this is a platform. They're totally different things. But if you look at it from the perspective of the behavior itself, then it's this very linear process of a behavior, you know, growing within an individual, growing outside of them in a back and forth way, and then th spreading into software so it can spread to more people. But you just see like a pattern of behavior growing through different mediums. And so I just, you know, usually when people ask culture questions and most people are almost culture blind, they're so within their culture, that's why they get into fights, that's why they have culture wars. They're not able to kind of step outside their own head and look at culture and what it's doing to them. And the few people who are good at modifying culture and generating culture seem to understand that it's a separate thing from the individuals or the groups and it's in a weird way kind of easier to understand and analyze and predict when you look at the behaviors themselves and how they might interact with each other or grow or spread. And this is why the people who are good at this tend to be polymaths who others look at them and say, well, what do you really do? Because you did this and then you did this and then you did that. And it's like, well, they were just following one meme through a few different um, cultures or cycles. So it's like, oh, well, you were doing ads for this person, then you designed this for that person. And, you know, it, it kind of looks very disparate, as if it was unfocused. But in fact, it's often hyper-focused on a meme that they ride through a few different industries or mediums, et cetera. Um, so yeah, I guess if anyone has any thoughts, leave a comment and jump up into the chat if you want.